The moon race between the United States and China has gained immense attention in recent years. Both nations are vying for dominance in lunar exploration, with ambitions that extend far beyond simply planting flags. At the heart of the moon race lies the quest for scientific exploration and technological advancement. For the United States, NASA has set its sights on returning astronauts to the moon through the Artemis program, aiming to establish a sustainable presence by the end of the decade. In addition to scientific objectives, national pride and geopolitical power play significant roles in this race. For the United States, maintaining its status as a leader in space exploration is paramount, especially in light of the advancements made by China. The Chinese government views lunar exploration as a means to assert its technological prowess and secure its place as a global superpower. The moon is seen not only as a stepping stone for deeper space exploration, but also as a resource hub that could yield valuable materials, such as helium-3, which has potential applications in nuclear fusion. The implications of this race extend beyond scientific and geopolitical realms. They also raise questions about international cooperation and space governance. With more countries and private entities interested in lunar exploration, the need for a framework that ensures peaceful collaboration and fair use of resources is paramount. While the United States and China race to establish their presence on the moon, their actions could set precedents for how celestial bodies are explored and used in the future. NASA and SpaceX have made significant strides in lunar exploration, particularly through the Artemis program, which aims to land the first woman and the next man on the moon by 2030. But China also has a mission. Who will be the first to land on the moon? Let's check the latest updates on both countries' lunar programs. Starting by United States Artemis program, this ambitious initiative is a pivotal part of NASA's broader vision to enable human exploration of Mars and beyond. The Artemis Lunar Lander mission serves as a crucial component in demonstrating advanced capabilities that will support future expeditions beyond Earth. The Artemis program not only signifies a monumental return to lunar exploration, but also embraces innovation and collaboration with commercial partners like SpaceX. Their joint efforts illustrate key moments in the development of lunar lander technology, including the design and testing of the spacecraft that will facilitate safe landings on the moon's surface. These technological advancements are critical as they lay the groundwork for sustainable lunar exploration, which is essential for future missions to Mars. One of the fascinating aspects of the Artemis program is its focus on inclusivity in space exploration. By aspiring to land the first woman on the moon, NASA emphasizes the importance of diversity in its missions. This initiative serves as an inspiration to future generations, showcasing that space exploration is an endeavor that welcomes all, regardless of gender or background. It is remarkable how the Artemis program not only aims to explore the lunar surface, but also advocates for equality and representation in science and technology fields. Moreover, the mission steps taken by NASA and SpaceX in developing the lunar lander reflect extensive research and collaboration spanning multiple disciplines. This includes meticulous planning and testing protocols to ensure the safety and effectiveness of the spacecraft. Engineers and scientists are working tirelessly to overcome the challenges posed by the harsh lunar environment, such as extreme temperatures, rugged terrain, and radiation exposure. As we look ahead, the Artemis lunar missions are setting a foundation for sustained human presence on the moon. With aspirations to establish a lunar base, these endeavors will enable scientists to conduct extensive research on the moon and gather valuable information that will inform our journey to Mars. The lessons learned from these missions will undoubtedly enhance our understanding of space travel, contributing to humanity's quest to explore the universe. Therefore, the partnership between NASA and SpaceX within the Artemis program represents a significant leap forward in lunar exploration, 
It embodies groundbreaking technology, a commitment to diversity, rigorous scientific research, and a vision for a future where humanity expands its reach in the cosmos. With each step forward, we are not only inching closer to the moon, but also paving the way for exciting ventures that lie ahead in our solar system. By the other hand, China is also making significant strides in its space exploration efforts, particularly with its upcoming manned lunar mission. Recently, at the Human Space Symposium in Shenzhen, the China Manned Space Agency unveiled new details that outline their ambitious plans. The presentation included a captivating animated video showcasing astronauts operating a lunar rover and navigating a detailed driving route on the moon's surface. This mission represents a monumental step in China's journey toward exploring our celestial neighbor. Central to China's lunar mission is the mastery of crucial technologies that will enable manned missions to the moon. The focus areas include Earth-Moon round trips, short-term lunar stays, and human-robot collaborative exploration. This multifaceted approach involves a plethora of tasks ranging from landing and roving on the lunar surface to sampling and conducting scientific research, all culminating in a safe return to Earth. With a target launch date set for 2030, China is working diligently to ensure that everything is in place for success. To support this mission, extensive groundwork has been laid. The development of various spacecraft components including the Long March 10 carrier rocket and the Mengzhou manned spacecraft, is well underway. Likewise, the lunar lander known as Lan Yu and specialized astronaut spacesuits are in production. The necessary facilities and equipment for testing these components have been completed, ensuring that the preparations are on schedule. Moreover, the Wenchang spacecraft launch site is also under construction, laying the foundation for future launches. Another exciting aspect of the lunar program is the emphasis on conducting large-scale scientific experiments. China aims to explore three vital areas, lunar science, lunar-based science, and the exploration and utilization of lunar resources. These experiments could open new doors for scientific discovery and practical applications that benefit life on Earth. The collaboration between astronauts and robotic technology will be essential in achieving these objectives, underscoring the blend of human ingenuity and technological advancement. As discussions at the Human Space Symposium reveal, the focus extends beyond the lunar mission itself. Experts, academicians, and astronauts are sharing insights on the achievements of the Chinese space station and the operation of the National Space Laboratory. This is indicative of China's broader goals in space exploration and the quest for knowledge that fosters innovation and international collaboration. The future of lunar exploration looks promising as China may lead the charge in redefining our understanding of space. At the end, the most important is to evolve in space exploration altogether, and although everyone wants to be the first to land another human on the moon, our efforts should go in a peaceful and collaborative direction.